They say your yeah, dreams is just like the lotto, no one get those But I go slow dropping down 50 lane dodging potholes New A drop for models, build a plan and keep the motto Started from the bottom, now the whole plan is colossal Elevated night from the last smoke, fuck the hype and fix your life on me pronto Limit heights and do it right, don't run to Got your wife, I might grab her like frontal Alright, so what is up everybody on YouTube? This is Bullet RC coming to you guys again with more energy than usual and uh, today we have a very dope pair of kicks and what really surprised me about this shoe was that the amount of people that didn't know what it was and the amount of people that actually just off top liked it. I mean it's a dope kick but I wasn't expecting the reception that it got on Instagram and what I'm saying is that these right here, let me see if I can remember the whole name, Flying It Trainer Chucka SFVSP. Yes, that is the full name of these. Um, if you can't see the shoe, don't worry about it. The lights, they'll blast out the white. B rolls coming for you. Don't worry about it. Um, what I mean by that is that the reception of these, these just got like posted on like I think sneaker shops posted them. Uh, like two other pages or two or three other pages posted them. And this this pair of shoes I think is the most liked picture on my Instagram of these kicks right here. Um, you guys seem to really like them. So I made sure that I got the video up. It's proper. You can see everything if you want to go grab them. Once again, they are hefty on the retail at 200, and I'm not sure what people are pushing them for resale-wise. Um, it was a Nike Lab thing, so once Nike Lab stuff sells out, people try to, you know, they try to push the price up a little bit. Nike Lab, this, this, and that. But the shoe to me um, it is an amazing shoe, and I say that because first off, I like flying it, and this is just an evolution on flying it, like. It, it has the, um, oh man, I forgot what it's called. I forgot what it's called. Hyperfuse on the back, hyperfuse on the front, kind of like toe guards, mud guards on the front and back. Once again, this is an all white shoe. Some people don't like to mess with all white shoes, but um, I dare to dabble with it. It doesn't really matter to me. I can keep them clean. I wore them one time and um, I got like some red Kool Aid on them on the mud guard, but it wiped right off. Luckily, it didn't hit the, um, <laughs> the fly knit. And apparently there's some added extras. Um, when I look on the inside, it says Defender Repellent Systems. And I'm pretty sure that's probably some type of thing to deal with rain. Um, the actual inside of this shoe is like coated extra. It's more, it's, it's just winterized once again. There's like extra, I don't know if it's a coating, just extra threading on the inside compared to a regular Finite Chukka. It's just a thicker, it's a thicker Chukka and that's probably why the price was raised as well as the midsole, you guys know it's kind of like that free but uh, like an ACG free sole um, very very raised on the bottom and um, I just think it's a really cool adaptation of a shoe that I already liked and loved to a winterized version all white version and um, I'm really glad people really like the shoe and, and it got such a great reception as it did on my Instagram once again it is at Bull RC if you guys want to go see that picture um, and people really like the white the white denim the white and the black denim, the last two denims I'm going to use are by 10 Deep. They are repair denim. Now what I'm going to say now is that they are expensive. They run for about 140 each. Um, and like I said guys, I'm going to be working on finding some other brands and street brands that are better priced. Because um, I understand not everyone can afford 10 Deep or Supreme and stuff like that. And I'm going to be working on finding stuff that is better priced but still fits good or is equally priced for the fit or equally priced for the quality and stuff like that. Um, I've really been liking H&M jeans. Um, I've actually gotten two more pairs like some the skinny fit and the slim low. And I'm going to be showing those off to you guys too and I just want to expand your guys' options um, farther than you. I usually just use a base number of pants or the khakis, the blacks, the blues, the white sometimes. And uh, yeah, so that's anyways as I was saying guys, this is just a dope shoe man. A winterized all white Flying it chucka, like that's me. That sounds like me. That's something I would like. And um, as I was saying, much love to all the fam, followers, and supporters. Let me know what you guys think about this kick right here. Is it worth the $200 in your opinion? Have you held it? Have you seen it to give your opinion on it completely? And um, if you like the video, go ahead and leave that thumbs up. And if you're not already, as I said before, go ahead and follow me on Instagram and Twitter at BulletRC. New stuff coming soon. As always, I shared my command forces. They were supposed to be here today, um, but then an update and they're still in Great Britain. So I don't know what they're doing with that. I'm going to see you guys in the next video. New videos coming soon.
Clockwork gang, she wanna party and hang with the lords of the land, god dang. God dang. Pass the off two tats for the end on the plane, she was going in a half, god dang. God dang. Roll a sit, fuck a gram, got a rocket in my hand, take a hit, that's a blast, god dang. God dang. When the sergeant in town, that the surge around, got it in my hand, bang, god dang, god dang. God dang.